Alright, welcome to PC21 Friends Chat Video 1. Um, I'm your host, PC21 slash Sarah. You can just call me Sarah. This is our little chat over here. It's not very big right now, but we do get some pretty good margins. So you should check our forums out. You can find them by googling pc201.formotion.com or just PC201 for motion works too. It should be the first link. Um, some of these items you're seeing are, are flips from last night. We had about 10, 15 people in here last night. This chat's about a year old now. We turned a year old in October. We split off of PC101, basically because I think it's silly to put limits on how many items you can do and what kinds of items. So this is pretty much anything goes here. Anything that's going to turn us a profit is what we're going to flip. So if I find a great margin on some bizarre item like U roots or potion flasks or something along those lines, we flip it. There's no, no limits. Uh, I bought this one at 23.85 last night. It was overnight, so I gotta, I gotta get rid of them so that I can buy some more. I don't want to get stuck with too many things. As you can see, I'm, I'm stuck with a lot of stuff right now. But uh, they should, we should be able to get rid of some of this stuff pretty soon. Torva, maybe not so much, but. But the ELYs are, they're kind of an odd item. We've managed to sell, I think, five now in the last couple weeks at like eight to ten mil over margin, over whatever Nexon SS has. So if they had like margin, it was 36 to 38. I had one sell at 46 last week, two of them actually. So um, ELY is kind of magical like that. I would not recommend hoping that, for instance, Torva is going to go up to 52 anytime soon or anywhere near. 51.5, but uh, for ELYs, you can kind of take a chance on those. They tend to go up and down a lot more. Virtuous Masks and Pernix Cowls are not my friends. I struggle with them every time, and I was like, maybe they'll be different last night. No, they weren't any different. So, I have updates from, from my FC. That's always good. And by the way, if anybody's interested in helping me update, always welcome to the help. Um, I'll take any any input, anything anybody has to offer. It's all welcome here. this for now so I can flip some other stuff so I can show you guys what what some of our profits look like here um, this is this is my notepad by the way this is where I keep all my uh, all my margins you can see it's it's pretty extensive there's a there's a lot of, of different things I do this is my I keep my profits log in the same area so that I can keep track of what I've made and you can see that some of these are I mean, it, this is this is since uh, September, so it's not it's not a super long profit so long, and I've been real busy with school, so I haven't been on that much. But it's not that bad for for being since September, and there's a lot of stuff on here that didn't get recorded. But um, we've made a lot off ELYs. I don't even I don't even know. That's not even close to the actual number. It says 22.485, but we've made way more than that off of ELY. I made about a mil and a half, well, a mil, 1100, that's what it was, 1100k off of uh, Dragon Hatchets the other day, that was pretty good, especially since it's a 10-4 item. Check a 10 4. It's been a while since I didn't. These prices are from last night. Let's check a. We'll check a dragon pickaxe real fast. So usual. Usual.
visual thing comes in. Buy high, sell low, figure out what the margin is. So the sell would be 15.449, but you never want to sell exactly on the sell because it takes forever. So I usually do a little bit below it. So we're going to do 15.445. And I'm going to mark our time over here so we remember when we did it. Okay, I'm going to sell it back under again. Fifteen point one six five. So we are going to do again a little bit over that that mark so that we can actually get one in a decent amount of time. We'll do fifteen point one seven five. Let's see if we can get one to close. Just so you guys know, I started off with, like, nothing. <laughs> I started flipping with probably... I scaled up to 11 mil. Then I won the jackpot on Squeal, but I got hacked due to my own stupidity. So, all that money went bye-bye. And then I had to borrow from my clanmates, and they were nice enough that they helped me out. And... I borrowed about another 11 mil, and then I flipped from that to like 50. Then I made, well it was more than that, more, more like 80. Then I made PC201, and I moved about 30 mil over from my main account. And I've been flipping ever since, and I'm pretty... I'm getting up there. I'm not quite where I want to be yet. I want to be able to do party hats and all of that, so I'm not quite that wealthy, but I'm getting there. Just got a, an update on our Armadale chain skirt, which bought at 8.9. Super ranging flasks are one of my favorite items. Um, if you buy them in the middle of the week and then you sell them later, like on the weekends, you can usually make about three to four mil off of a thousand of them. So it's pretty cool. I also want to point out that um this chat that I have here is much, much more laid back than your, your typical friend chats that are, that are big for a small chat, but, um, there's really not a whole lot of rules. I'm trying to teach people more how to, how to flip without needing somebody to hold their hand the whole time. So, see, see, he just asked me, do you guys know trend? I'll take any trends. I, d I don't mind if you guys talk about which way an item is going or how much you paid last night or last week or whatever, how much you made off of it. It doesn't matter because what really matters is teaching people how to make money. Oh, there's a dragon pickaxe. There's two of them. Sell them. 15.445. I think I'm about to be out of video, so I may have to continue this in part two.